Princess Catherine of Wales, who recently shared her cancer diagnosis publicly, is currently undergoing what she called preventative chemotherapy. Due to an unexpected commitment at Easter service confirmed from the palace this year, the princess would spend time with family at Anwar Hall, Norfolk. This coincides with the children's school holidays, giving families the opportunity to spend quality time together. The mom of three was supposed to take some time off to rest and recover during this period. However, due to her boundless love for her three adorable children, she still takes care of them herself despite being in recovery. Amidst the picturesque surroundings of Norfolk, the royal family shared heartwarming moments that captivated the public's attention. At Anmer Hall, it is just the five of them at home, with Catherine, rather than a cook or housekeeper, usually preparing dinner. She cooks spicy curry, three beloved children's favorite food every day, and a spicier one for her and William. Pizza is one of George, Charlotte, and Louis's favorite food. According to their mother, she admitted making pizza dough together. They love it because they can get their hands messy, she added. We can imagine how much Prince George we can imagine how much Prince George, Princess Charlotte, and little Prince Louis enjoy their mother's homemade meals after a long semester. Having been known to have an unconventional taste in food herself, the Princess of Wales has shared an insight into how her three children eat over the years. Her husband, Prince William, has joked in the past that his wife is better in the kitchen than he is. Catherine previously mentioned to the children that her own children enjoy apples and cereal in the morning, which spark a conversation with the children about her own preference of fruits. She also has shown her ability to connect with other parents who encourage their children to help cook in the kitchen. A lovely story about her children helped the princess make cheesy pasta. Away from social media, the family enjoyed the simple joys of togetherness, creating cherished memories that will undoubtedly last a lifetime. The Princess of Wales is always proud of Prince George, Princess Charlotte, and Prince Louis. Becoming a mother has been such a rewarding and wonderful experience for her. Before officially announcing the cancer diagnosis at 6 p.m., when Prince George, Princess Charlotte, and Prince Louis finish school, William and Catherine thought of many ways to reveal it to the children. In her video, the Princess of Wales said the news of her cancer had been a huge shock. It had taken her and William time to explain everything to George. Charlotte and and Louis in a way that is appropriate for them, and to reassure them that I am going to be okay. After that, Princess Catherine and Prince William chose to spend the Easter holidays helping the children to understand and accept their mother's illness. Last month, she was seen riding in the passenger seat of car driven by her mother, Carol Middleton. The mother-daughter duo were on the school run on the way back from dropping off Prince George, Princess Charlotte, and Prince Louis at Lambrook School, where all three attend, many breaking news stated. Going back to the time when Catherine was in the hospital, children were generally not allowed to visit the London Clinic without permission from the hospital for the safety of the patients and to keep infections at bay. Therefore, the Princess of Wales didn't have Prince George, Princess Charlotte, and Prince Louis visit her in the hospital. Instead, she stayed connected to her children via FaceTime, which she and William regularly do when they are away from the children on royal tours. On April 17, Prince George, Princess Charlotte, and Prince Louis will return to Lambrick School near Ascot. William will then resume the working pattern he has maintained since the beginning of the year, performing both official duties and supporting his wife and family, which often includes running the school.